Nobody's face is too complicated to turn into a pastry. For the most part, I make pies of people that I like and respect. And it's cool if other people like and respect them too. That's always a nice bonus. People like the country music television or the Turner Network or places like that have called me up and asked me to make pies for Dolly Parton and Dakota Fanning and just like random interesting people. I did realize the hard way that you have to pick a pie dough that's not going to warp and puff up in the oven if you're doing someone's likeness. Certain types of pie, like if you've got an all butter pie with let's say carbonated water in it, it's going to puff up, which is nice and delicious. But if it's somebody's face, you don't want them to have like a big goiter or, you know, strange pastry tumors all over their face. So when I'm doing um, people, I usually do shortening base pies because it doesn't puff up. For the ones that's just somebody's face on a pie, that takes about an hour. But then for some of the pie scrapers, like the multi-tiered pies that I do, those can take a couple of days. If they didn't taste as good as they look, I would not be doing this. I've gotten requests for people to um, have their own portrait with a celebrity, <laughs> as if it was them getting married to this person, I'm like, eh, I don't know about that. For the most part, people are fairly, you know, they look at things that I've already made and they're like, I like that. Mm -hmm.